Hi everyone, welcome back. Um, I got my COVID vaccine. Just a disclaimer, my brother's budgies are tweeting like maniacs. So um, if you hear that, I'm sitting right beside him. So if you hear that, that if you hear tweeting, that's why. So I got my COVID vaccine. Um, I was originally meant to get on the 16th, but I'm getting it on the 22nd because on the 16th day, this Ireland's is like the Sunday before, I was going to get it that Tuesday, but the Sunday before they Ireland suspended it, so they cancelled my appointment. But they said that there's no evidence of blood clots, so um, so the the European report came out saying there's no evidence of blood clots, so they resumed the rollout. I think on the twentieth. Don't quote me on that, but um, and I got a text that Saturday saying that um that my appointment for the vaccine is on the twenty second, which was really exciting. Um so the twenty second was that Monday. I got the text on Saturday night and um my vaccine was that Monday at two at ten I think. Ten minutes past two. So it was good. Um, I wasn't expecting to actually get a, get the vaccine in general that quick. If some, if you're wondering why I got the vaccine and I'm so young, I have type one diabetes and other autoimmune conditions. I have rheumatoid arthritis and um, type one diabetes. So um, so type one diabetes. For, qualified me for it because I'm in um I live in Ireland so I live in uh I'm on on number four on the list like for my illnesses I'm on number four and I forgot to mention that I live in Ireland so um so we pres resumed the rollout on the twentieth but other countries are different and stuff um so um. I went in, I got mine done in the hospital, so I went in, um, got checked in, uh, waiting in the hall, got called, got my vaccine, then um, had to go into this room for 15 minutes where I got water and stuff, and they just had to check to make sure you wouldn't have any anti anticlaxis, like just a reaction, just make sure you wouldn't have a reaction to it. Um, so... Um, my side effects, I got quite bad side effects, but in saying that I get side effects for every single vaccine I take, I'm I'm very unfortunate. I got the AstraZeneca vaccine, which um is known for causing side effects in people. So um, I was the girl told me that I was in for about forty eight hours. Sorry for the birds. Um, I was in a row for I was. I was in for about 48 hours, so um, I had a temperature, that's why I'm actually red at the minute. Um, I, have a temp I had a temperature, muscle pains, um, headache, nausea, sore arm, weakness, general feeling of, um, general of not feeling well. The general feeling I'm not feeling well. I'm not gonna say what I was going to say because I'm gonna be YouTube will um take down the video for bad language so um <laughs> but I felt um quite terrible. I got headaches and everything and I got muscle pain and I just got really fatigued but I didn't feel it to that night like and um I went to visit Lexi beforehand because I didn't think I'd be able to go the next day. So I went, no, I went to see her after, sorry, the vaccine, before the side effects kicked in. Um, so um, I'll insert a video of me visiting Lexi. I didn't write or anything. Then the next day I didn't go to her because I didn't feel well because of the side effects. And I'm currently nearly seven, I'm nearly 78 hours after, but I still feel some effects. But in saying that, like, I have a lot of health issues, so I probably 
will feel it a lot longer than most people. So um, don't be discouraged. Don't use me as an excuse to not get the vaccine. Be because it is a life saving um it is life saving medicine that's that would save so many people's lives. And I highly recommend everybody gets vaccinated when your turn pops up. Because if I contracted coronavirus I would die because of the mental illnesses I have or end up with like serious damage but probably would die. So um So yeah, that's about it. Uh, I'm going to be monitoring my comment section so any anti-vaxxers or people spreading misinformation will be banned uh, from it. I'm actually feeling a lot better today. Uh, I'm nearly 78 hours. It'll be 78 hours this afternoon. And I'm feeling like so much better. Um, a lot of my headache and nausea went away. Um, I just have a sore arm and muscle pain. Um, muscle pain. I feel fatigued and my legs, my body just feels tired. But other than that, like it's pretty much almost gone. So, um, thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe for more. I know this is different. Oh, and Lexi is my horse for anybody wondering, because <laughs> I probably have, um, this is an equestrian channel for anybody who's new here. Um, this is not my normal type of video, but I decided why not tell you my experience. So it'll put e people at ease.